welcome to my channel it's your girl Jalissa. how you doing i hope everyone's good i hope everyone's blessed if you're new to my channel a little hug for you what's up welcome to the family all right and if you're a returning viewer how you doing what's going on my ogs bless um first and foremost i want to say thank you to everybody for liking sharing subscribing to my channel it's really made my channel grow tremendously in days and i i'm just like blessed i feel it in my heart thank you okay <laughs> got that out the way uh so yeah if this resonates with you please like share subscribe to my channel it helps it grow so i, I appreciate that all right leave me a comment down below i live for the tea i write back to everybody all right you want a private read that information is down below as well and there's going to be an extended for how's the next time going to be with your person so if you want to know about that go down below and figure it out <laughs> let's see let's get into it hey Taurus. How y'all doing? I hope everyone's blessed. Let's get it. Let's get into this. All right. Let's see, Taurus, what we got going on here. Oh, before I do this, how could I not? Let's crown the reading. For reals. What is crowning Taurus is reading to this spirit? Ooh. <laughs> What's crowning the reading? The Empress, the Hangman, and the and the Hierophant. Ooh, there's some judgment and movement and balance. Oh, somebody having a tower out here. Oh Jesus. Let's see what's going on. So I see I see here, Taurus, that you're crowning your own reading, right? Empress, you guys are out here being your best divine feminines out here. Even if you are a masculine, you're out here being your divine masculine, right? You're out being your best person out here. I feel you. So, Taurus, I see that you guys are doing the best. You guys are sitting in your position. You're holding down the fort. You guys are being amazing. But there's something you want to do. There's a, there's a direction you want to go, but you're not going there right now. You're kind of stuck. You're in this energy where you don't know which way you want to go, right? Left, right. Which way are we going? So let's try to figure it out. Let's see what's going on here with your love life tours. Because you, you're trying to make a choice. We have the Hierophant here. So, you know, this definitely could be involving marriage. This could be involving um, some type of guidance you're receiving from above. This could be this could be this could be inquiring many 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 different things with the higher fin here, but definitely the divine is here. The divine is definitely here. The divine is definitely gonna help with the situation. So your situation also could be dealing with your views, your religious views on life. Your your love life could be dealing with something of that nature as well. But let's see, spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides. What is crowning the reading here for Taurus today? What is crowning the reading here for Taurus today? Oh, it just flew, okay? At the bottom of the deck, let your friends help you. Ask and accept support from others, okay? Let's see what we have here. We have strong chemistry. So there is definitely a strong chemistry here, Taurus. With your person, there's some family issues that need to be healed. You know, whether it's mommy or daddy issues with you or your person, but there's definitely some family wounds that need to be healed and you need to keep your mind open all right keep an open mind because this could be your soulmate Taurus all right your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations so this is something that you're thinking I don't know do I go left do I go right let's see what's going on with Taurus right now <clears throat> this person you and this person definitely equally have a strong chemistry in regards to each other like your person feels like you're a magnet you feel like your person's a magnet there's a strong magnetic connection here like this person is like not just your regular joe this is like someone that really has grabbed your 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 feelings your love and this person has there's just love fire and emotions here and happiness i, I feel it so strongly there's just this big what if what's going on yeah this this is involving an exclusive relationship there's there's a need to invest in this because this relationship will be if not already exclusive for sure 
All right, Taurus. Yeah, there's just some patterns here. I feel like this, the patterns are coming from family issues. Your person may have mommy or daddy issues and um or you, Taurus. This could be patterns. Oh my god, that's too much. That's <laughs> very long. All right. Okay, so here we go. Someone may have left or someone is going to feel like leaving, right? Your love love yourself enough only to accept the best. Let go of the wrong person, be comfortable being alone. So listen, someone may have left here because we have the escape artist or someone is planning to leave and then the later dude. So this is like something of like, this could be your person, right? And or you, however it resonates. But someone's leaving because they feel like they, they're scared. They're scared of love. May sabotage and to avoid hurt, avoid to be loved. Afraid to be loved, still looking, don't run when it gets real. So this situation is getting real. It's really real. Yeah, see, someone did leave or someone is leaving because there's leaving space here. I definitely see that. Um, There's a need for you to love yourself more, Taurus. Like, I feel like you give a lot to this relationship. And I feel like it needs to be returned. And I don't, I don't feel that it's being returned, but that's only for some. Communication. Address concern without attacking person. Communication is the issue here. Healthy love dialogue. So, like... If you you need to communicate with your person you guys need to be at the same level like there's some type of issue here with your communication either your person's not hearing you out or you're not hearing your person out i feel like it's your person that's not hearing you out because maybe you're kind of being a little bit aggressive or expressing your feelings very strongly and your person feels like you're attacking them because this may come like i said from mommy daddy issues or something that happened to them in their childhood like it's it scares them they're like, oh my God, you know? But this person does have a pattern. Relational abuse. Notice red flags, okay? That may be emotional, physical, financial in nature. Ask for help in situation. Grass is greener. Passing up options. Too quick to decide. Take time to know them. Gratitude changes circumstances. Yeah, so like there is an energy here. Should I go? Should I stay? That's why the hangman's here. Because you don't know what to do. There are strong feelings here, but you don't know if you should leave because your person's probably trying or, or probably not investing as much as you are. Because I feel, Taurus, you are definitely investing a lot in this relationship. But your person may have left or, yeah. There's a, there's a vibe of you needing to heal, Taurus. And really, really evaluating the situation. But this does... Ex this does definitely talk about girlfriend boyfriend vibes like exclusiveness commitment marriage life partner you know so i just feel like things are on the fence but at the end of the day like you may be thinking your person may be thinking about the grass being green or somewhere else but it's really not like the love connection here is very strong i feel it i feel it i feel it i feel it all right so let's get into the tarot let's see what's up here very ancient ancestors you know it's from the channel messages from Taurus. Definitely lots of chemistry. Like I, I would not be surprised if you guys are like if this is a spiritual connection, soulmates, twin flames for real. Because we have the Empress, we have that total chemistry, you know, we have just so much going on here. The higher fit, like definitely, like you guys people look up to this relationship, believe it or not. Um, spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, please come forth and help me channel the messages for Taurus. What is Taurus's person's mental space right now? What is Taurus mental Taurus person's mental space right now? Oh my God, that's a lot, spirit. <laughs> One or two cards, spirit, please. What is their mental space right now? We have judgment in reverse at the bottom of the deck, so definitely um an energy of being in denial your person's in denial they're scared of some type of change this change makes them feel weak all right so your person's mental space is ace of pentacles they may be seeking a new job or wanting a new job they want to start something new definitely get a gift for you they feel like you deserve this they're thinking about we have the five of wands in reverse they're definitely thinking about like harmony having success with you and you know, like, they want the issues and the problems to be done with, all right? They want to resolve these these matters with you, Taurus. They're thinking about you, Taurus. 
they're thinking about how smart and capable you are and how much you're like um a non nonsense type of person they're like damn my boo is mad smart you know like that they're really just focusing on you they're focusing on getting the situation back to a balanced level calmer waters and they're thinking about a new job like they're, they want to get a better job or get something going in regards to finances because they're part i feel like they're not happy where they're at right now in their career all right so it's like they're trying to like balance they're trying to see what they can do but they're definitely thinking about you Taurus. if you thought they weren't thinking about you they're out here thinking about you okay spirit what is a combined mental thought in regards to Taurus and their person what are they both thinking about wow i can't make this up you're both thinking about yourselves like each other like you're you're thinking about your person and your person's thinking about you oh goodness what else there is there anything else they're both thinking about the bottom of the deck the sun happiness you guys are both thinking about happiness with each other yeah look all right we have the knight of swords right there and then we have the six of swords here and the lovers like i just love that right first of all beautiful 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 all right so you're both thinking about how to get over the chaos all right you guys are both thinking about how to get over the chaos you know you're both thinking about each other your person's thinking about you and you're thinking about your person and you're both thinking about how to get to calmer waters like you're over the shit you're over the bs you're over the arguing you're over whatever happened in the past and you guys want to go towards happiness you want your happiness you want balance yeah there was a heart oh, a broken heart here someone's heart got broken here both of y'all hearts got broken here and it could have been because of a, a third party it could have been many scenarios as to why your heart got broken but i see that it could have easily been a third party scenario um yeah your person wants to give you something a gift yeah your person is like very being a little bit immature right now very like you know like being a little bit immature that's all i gotta say being dependent on you a lot but they're very passionate they just feel like they have a lot going on like their load is like they have too much going on. They're waiting for something to happen here, Taurus, with you, their empress, all right? They're very clouded. They're not seeing straight right now. Yeah, they're spying on you. They're, they're like watching you from afar. And Taurus, you may be acting up out here in these streets, okay? You may be very cold to your person, <laughs> okay? Definitely. Yeah, but there's some, some your, your person feels like they need support. They need help in regards to finances. Like, they want to... They want to go somewhere different with their finances. They want to get more money. They don't feel like they have enough right now. Yeah, there's this energy here of like, of like fully like having clarity, you know? Like there's going to be clarity here, Taurus, in regards to your situation. Because this person is in denial, definitely clouded. And they, feel, they feel lonely right now, Taurus. They're feeling lonely. No matter how close or far you are from each other, this person is feeling lonely inside. They feel isolated. They're just repeating past hurts, things that they've done to you. They see you as a very strong person, Taurus. They see you as a wish fulfillment. They see hope when it comes to you. But right now, they're just not happy. They're not happy right now. They want to celebrate with you. And like I said, this could be involving a third-party scenario for most of you. But it doesn't have to. But that's just crazy. That's what I'm seeing there for some of you guys. All right. So, Spirit, where is Taurus's mind right now? What is Taurus thinking about right now? What is their focus right now in regards to this relationship? What is Taurus thinking? Oh, okay. Taurus, you out here thinking about the fact that your person let you down. Your person really has you down and out and disappointed. Oh, no. Why is Taurus disappointed, Spirit? Because you've been giving more than you've been getting. You've been giving more into this relationship than you've been getting. Wow. Is there another reason, Spirit, why Taurus is thinking like this? Why is Taurus disappointed? Oh, okay. You're also disappointed because you're not seeing certain things. Like, you feel like things aren't clear enough for you right now. You're feeling like... You're disappointed because you feel like you're 
you're just like not seeing certain things right now like you're trying to be flexible but you don't feel like you can be flexible because you're not seeing things just the way how they should be so there's like a blur like a block uh, a cloud you know what i mean so you're very disappointed because this is like not clear to you the situation and your person may have literally let you down definitely feeling let down because you gave more than this person did all right is there anything else taurus is disappointed with is there anything else okay yeah you're 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 disappointed but spirit is saying there's gonna be clarity this illusion is gonna end you're gonna have clarity on this situation taurus okay all right so let's see what, what was this yeah you're definitely gonna have clarity on it you feel like this person isn't really being supportive when it comes to the relationship um spirit what is okay they just keep telling me things yeah <laughs> like hello your person hasn't been honest this is why you feel disappointed and let down spirit what is taurus's person um what is their challenge right now what is this taurus person challenge what is their challenge in this relationship Taurus's partner what is their challenge <clears throat> well they have a lot of challenges yeah major challenge they're trying to make a choice and they don't know which way to go all right so we got a lot their challenge is all right let, oh my god your person is out here just saying it all to me okay i got you boo their challenge is definitely like lighting up the situation freedom like they feel like they, they feel like they they really fucked up out here because their challenge is getting you happy giving you ultimate fulfillment because they broke your heart they feel like they broke your heart how they're gonna get you happy again you know they want to they want to be passionate and go towards you passionately but it's a challenge for them because they feel like you're pissed you're angry you're cold with them right now all right and look at this their challenge is also that they have a big ass ego all right they have a big ego and they don't know how to admit when they're wrong they're being very immature that's their challenge and they want to make a choice but they don't know which way to go because they want happiness with you they want marriage they want success they want to celebrate they want all stability with you but they feel overwhelmed why because they're over here being all immature and stuff they're trying to make a choice which way to go because they're all sad and disappointed and they're over this energy. They're over this. They're moving on. They're forgiving. They're hoping to come back home to you. Give you a gift. Yeah, and be stable with you. Okay, so Spirit, what is the overall together challenge with Taurus and their person? What is Taurus and their person's challenges? We have the Three of Cups here. So one of your challenges is happiness definitely with your person but i feel like this this for some of you guys is a third party scenario okay so that could be a challenge too the fact that your your person likes to possibly drink i hear and and do stupid things for some of you so um you guys both have a challenge with the four of swords in reverse so you both feel restless right now you both the challenge between both of you guys is that you're both tired y'all both restless y'all feel y'all both of y'all feel burnt out in this relationship right and then you both feel like um my nose is so itchy this happens when i channel um and you both feel like um your, your challenge is both trying to find hope in the situation and trying to free up the energy in this situation okay so that's what you're both struggling with like balance you know freedom having happiness again because you both feel tired and burnt out you both feel it all right spirit what is taurus's challenge in this relationship what is taurus's challenge in this relationship your person <laughs> stability with your person uh passion you're, you you want to express something passionately to your person and this is a challenge we have justice in reverse so your challenge is the fact that your person is not honest with you and for some of you some legal matters paperwork legal matters something to do with money your challenge is also that you guys may feel a little bit financially dependent on your person for some of you guys 
and for others you definitely feel like a little bit jealous of your person that is a challenge in this relationship another challenge is balance and just overall stability and happiness with your person is a challenge because this is your twin flame all right titles don't matter but i'm just throwing it out there this is your twin flame your challenge is your person there something happened there was a disaster there was some type of breakdown in the situation someone walked away from this because they just felt like out of place you know there was weak boundaries here quitting too soon but something fast is about to happen all right because um there's gonna be confidence all right there's just something you're not seeing that's about to happen all right so spirit what can taurus expect with their person What can Taurus expect from their person? That, that flew. You saw how that flew? You could expect your person like literally fast coming towards your way or coming towards a decision. Definitely fast. Wow. For, this person's going to fly to you. What else can Taurus expect? Sheesh. Oh, yeah. They're coming back. They're coming back. They want to have happy times with you. Mm -hmm. they're, they're missing the happy times with you. They want to come back. Yeah, you guys are definitely twin flames. Like, <laughs> Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's going to be a little bit delayed because this person is feeling a little bit down and out. There's going to be a wait, but this is what your person wants. Happiness. You could expect this. You could expect delays and you could expect to wait for this to happen, but it's going to happen. But you could expect happiness for sure. Okay. Spirit, ancient ancestors, what can they both expect from this relationship? What are they both expecting from this relationship? What can they both expect from this relationship? What can they both expect from this relationship? <laughs> the hangman in reverse this time, okay? So we have the hangman here, but we have the hangman in reverse this time. What you could expect is like, seriously? Like... What you can expect is like literally from both of you guys. Both of you guys are gonna be like feeling like you're you're the victim and the other person is the traitor. Like you can expect like <laughs> you can expect like feeling like you may like things didn't start off the way they were supposed to start, but you could expect like a passionate beginning. Like a passionate like your person coming towards you passionately wanting to like start things off new. Wanting to give you a message because they see you as their emperor, as, as their empress. Their feelings are scattered right now, you know. They they feel like they need to recover. Like there's been a lot of abuse in the situation, and there was like a tower moment here, but they you know they want to come back and they want to come back sweet. All right, spirit. What can Taurus expect overall? What can Taurus expect overall in general? What can they expect from their lover? Oh, This is your soulmate. You could expect, like, Spirit, can you clarify this two of cups in reverse? The moon. You're not seeing this, and it won't, it's not, it's coming out like the two of cups. So the two of cups in reverse definitely speaks about separation, arguments, breakups. So you guys... This is what spirit is saying. Overall, you could expect a breakup. Okay, I'm gonna see if I could get more clarity on that. I don't like that outcome. Okay, but you're not gonna see this coming. This per you can't. You know, this person wants to give you something. They want to give you a gift. They want to talk to you about money, but there's still unfinished lessons here. Okay, but they definitely want to be with you and they want to start something new with you. They want to talk to you. They want to recover from the situation. Because they're literally feeling like, you know, they want to have a new outlook, a new direction on this. They're just very clouded, babes. They're very clouded. They don't know where to go, which way to go. They're confused. All right? So overall, Taurus, you could expect to like, you know, you this is your soulmate, you know? So you could expect like seriously like... For some, it's going to be reconciliation, and for some, it's going to be a breakup. I'm going to be honest, and you're not going to see this happening or coming. But this is a lesson that needs to be learned. And after that lesson is learned, there will be an offer. 
this for you're gonna see you, you don't see this coming but there will be an offer there will be strength and clarity from the situation your person is just hella confused they don't know what to do they don't know where where to go what to do or what's what Jeez louise all right let me see something hold on let's see something taurus Let's see something. The spirit is not so sujin and I swear to God. Spirit, overall, overall, what is to be expected for Taurus and their person? What is to be expected from Taurus and their person? Yep, lessons that need to be learned. Yeah, be feeling stuck in the scenario. Well, something just flipped here. Well, your person, your person could be a very sweet, kind person, very gentle, warm, thought thinking person, whether man or female. Yeah, they they definitely want to give you something. There needs to be repairs in this relationship. Things didn't go the way you wanted them to go. But the load is going to lighten up. You guys are going to take a break. It's not like a breakup. It's just like a break. Because your person needs to see things from a different point of view. Spirit, can you clarify the world in reverse? What unfinished lessons does you and your person have? I want to know. Spirit, can you clarify the world in reverse? Yeah, there's unfinished lessons with your person. Your person needs to learn some lessons. They haven't they haven't finished learning their lesson. Spirit, can you clarify the King of Pentacles? Yeah, because of the broken heart. They haven't learned from that broken heart, from that situation. Yeah, setbacks. All right, Spirit, can you please... Um, This person needs to give you an apology. There's like an apology that has to come. This is what this is gonna be like a going around and around until they give you this apology, all right? Um, spirit, can you please clarify the three of swords in reverse? This is like spirit is like punishing them. Can I get a three of a clarification card? Yeah, they're very clouded. They're very clouded. They don't even know what they're doing, honestly. They're out here being messy. Spirit, can I get up? Yeah, they're they're and they're very concerned about money. They're very, very concerned about money. They're having conflicts with themselves and they're feeling lonely because of some money matters. Spirit, can you please give me another clarification card in regards to the... Okay, what was that? Yeah, they're out here still having a big ego. Your person hasn't learned. They need to learn. They need to come out of this energy before things could go smoothly with you, Taurus. Spirit, can I get one more card? Thank you. Yeah. But they are going to take a leap of faith. Spirit, can you clarify the, the fool, please? Oh. Oh, wow. Because they want to be with their lover. They want to they wanna make things right with their lover. Yeah, they're very sad right now. They're over this energy of feeling sad. They want to move on to happier times. But there's something they're not seeing. You know? And there's something you don't see coming. You don't see it coming. The Ten of Cups, happiness, family, fulfillment, you know? But there's still going to be this blame game. Who did who wrong? Who did who right? You know what I'm saying? Okay, so this is definitely coming. I wanted to see. I wanted to hear. I wanted to hear it because I'm like, what? I want to see what's going on with this heartbreak. I'm going in for y'all, Taurus. <laughs> Listen, I just, I just don't want to know, you know? Yeah, they want they want to be with you fast. Why? Because you're their soulmate. They feel rejected. They feel upset. Like they're all over the place right now. They're feeling like they they feel like they have a lack of confidence. And it could be because of the stupid ass third party scenario that went on, or just people not people gossiping about you guys, and not being supportive, you know, and them not giving you what you need because they know that you're a queen. They're gonna return. Yeah, they want to be with you. They're just resting right now. And you're waiting out here for them. There's a choice to be made. They're not making it because they're stupid. No offense. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. They're not making it because they're confused. Um, Spirit. 
and Janelle says, is your name special, guys? Please come forward and help me find the messages from Taurus. What is this heartbreak? Can you please clarify this heartbreak? What happened here between Taurus and their person? Yeah, well, I see there was a heartbreak for sure. Can you, can you clarify the temperance in reverse? Um, Because they didn't make a decision. They didn't make a decision they needed to make, but they were clouded. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. This person just keeps coming up with a big-ass ego. <laughs> there was complications and a lot of chaos because of their ego. Spirit, can you clarify the emperor's the emperor in reverse? Yeah. Yeah, this person may have been a little bit greedy with their time, with their love, with their money. Oh, but they're going to come and offer you a cup of love. Why? Because you're the queen of pentacles to them. Yep, they're spying on you, sweetheart. They're out here spying on you. Stress, worrying if you're going to be with someone else. They're worried about this ending, you know, but they want to be stable with you. All right, awesome. Now let's see what your person wants to say to you. Now that we got that out the way. I couldn't I couldn't leave you like that, Taurus. I couldn't I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I was like, nah. I'm not gonna leave Taurus out here like that. What? Like what? Nah. We we had to figure it out. Spirit ancient ancestors. What does Taurus person want to say to them at this time? What does Taurus person want to say to them at this time? Alright, that's good. That's enough, Taurus person. At the end, you mean the world to me. Let's put this as, um, I'm gonna make this the, the, oh, snappy. Hold on. Oh, it's because my phone's about to die. Thank you for notifying me, phone. I'm out here recording without having the phone on the charger. Let me get that plugged in. But, um, I gotta crown this. Hold on. Have a Give me one second, guys. Just one second so I can plug this in. Last thing I want is to record and not have messed up. All right, look. This is what's crowning the reading. Yep. There we go. Beautiful. You mean the world to me. All right? Your person wants you to know you mean the world to them. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Being vulnerable scares me. You scare the shit out of this person because you're strong, Taurus. You're strong. And they feel weak next to you. My heart beats so fast when I see you. You are much more beautiful than you know. You are as beautiful on the inside as you are on the outside. P.S. I love you, your boo. You always know just what to say to make me smile. You make me see things within myself I'm scared to see. You are my eternal love. You have my heart, that's for sure. You are my angel, wow. I can feel you close to me, wow. You are the best thing that has happened to me, amazing. I was made to love you, Taurus, we know that. Hmm. I cannot hide my smiles even when we are apart. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's see what they wanna say to you sexy time. Remember, there's going to be an extended reading, guys. The information for that is down below if you want to know how your next sexy time is going to be with this person. Okay? Spirit, ancient ancestors, and as well. What does the person want to say to them on the sexy note? All right. At the bottom of the deck, I have... There are... <laughs> there's an ache I can't control in a place I can't name. It calls for you. Damn. Okay. Dirty thoughts of you run through my mind all the time. Bite marks are love notes written in the flesh. They want to dominate you. They want to, they want to make sure you don't see no one else. Hot, rough sex. Yeah. I love when you tell me I'm yours. They need that clarification. Making you horny and making you smile are my two favorite things. Aww. All right, time for the charmies. <laughs> Aww. If you have headphones on or regardless, this gets loud, so caution. What are the charming sisters? 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 Alright, Taurus. Let's see what we got for you here today. 
First, we're going to go with the cards. We have the six of wands. Aww. There's going to be success here, babes. We have the seven of cups. Definitely. You know, listen, there's options. Your person is just very overwhelmed right now. But you know that they're making a choice right now, okay? Now, first, middle, last initials. We have Z as in zebra. Another Z, so ZZ. We have J as in Jonathan, Jr. We have G as in George, Gary. We have another Z, so that's like maybe you need some sleep. We have M, we have M as in Mike. M as in Mary, and W as in Wendell, W as in we. <laughs> we have B as in Brian, B as in Brandon, and Barry. Anything else? No, okay, we'll keep going. So we have the lucky, the clover here, the good luck clover. Because luck is coming your way, Taurus, okay? We have the leaf here, so things are, are, like, this person is letting go of things that no longer serve them, okay? So they're, like, letting go of the bad. We have the triangle here, signifying for those that were in that third-party situation, but the divine is here to set things straight for you guys. We have made with love. So this situation definitely was made with love. Like, don't ever doubt if this had love in it. It definitely did. We have the heart with the paw. Your person is very loyal, believe it or not, to you. We have the horse with the, the unicorn here with the nice, beautiful hair. That's because you guys are very unique, Taurus. You guys are unique and people see this in you. We have the infinity symbol. The divine is definitely here and they're definitely helping your situation. We have the mermaid here. Your person finds you very sexy, Taurus. Very, very sexy. And some of you guys are mermaids, okay? Like me. We have the heart with the peace symbol. So there will be peace and resolution here in this situation. Definitely reconciliation for some of you. We have here the anchor. Because this situation calls for you to stop, chill, and reflect before you make any decisions or say anything. Make sure to use kind, sweet words. We have another infinity symbol. This definitely means that your person loves you just as much as you love them. We have the new, we have the little birdie here because love is returning back to you, Taurus. Love is coming back. Love is here. Taurus, you're kind, you're you're free, you're true, you're brave, you're strong, you're thankful, you're compassionate. Remember that. What's for you will not pass you, Taurus. What's for you will not pass you, Taurus. Remember that. We have here the Wheel of Fortune. So definitely something major is about to happen and shift in your favor, Taurus. We have the little perfume bottle here. Your person feels that you smell really good. We have the owl. So there's a need for you to like literally meditate, listen to your intuition, and look within, okay? You guys are definitely... Definitely spiritual and definitely wise, okay? Well, that was all, Taurus. So please like, share, subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what happened here. Also, if you want to go to the extended, I'll meet you there. <laughs> Thanks. Bless. See you guys.